follow me now. Today, I'm going to show you how to find the volume of a triangular prism, triangular pyramid, and a square pyramid in a simple way. It basically looks like, like a tent. is 12 centimeters and the height of the triangle is 8 centimeters and the height of the triangular prism is 20 centimeters. Let's start with the formula for the triangular prism is V equals capital B times H. Now, capital B is, is the area of the base. Area of the base. And the, in the base, in this problem for a triangular prism, is this triangle. Okay? So, to find the volume, we're going to have to find the area of the triangle first and then multiply times the height of the triangular prism. So V equals area of the triangle is one half times the base of the triangle times the height of the triangle. These will be your capital B. Then, we have to multiply it times the height of the triangular prism. Let's continue. V equals one half. Now I'm going to substitute the values of these letters, which is 12. And I'm going to use parentheses to represent it and eight for the height. Remember parentheses represent multiplication and then the height of the triangular prism which is 20. V equals 12 times eight is 96 times one half and then times 20. All I did is multiply the 12 times the 8. You can start from right to left if you want. Remember the order operation for multiplication and division. It doesn't matter where you start, you still get the same answer. So I'm starting here 12 times 8 is 96, and then rewriting um, the 1 half and the 20. So V equals. 96 times 1 divided by 2. So 96 divided by 2 is 48. Then we have to multiply 48 times 20, which is 960. And we're talking about centimeters, so it will be cubic centimeters. And this is our answer. Talk about the volume of a triangular pyramid. I'm going to highlight one of the sides so that you can see it. For this specific example, uh, we're going to start with the formula for uh, to find the volume of the triangular pyramid, which is V equals one third times capital B times capital H. Okay, so V equals one third 
times capital B. Remember that capital B represents the area of the base and the base is a triangle, so we will have to find the area of the triangle, multiply times the height, and divide it by three. Now, let me give you the dimensions. 0.5, and let's start using decimals for this one. 4.5 centimeters. By giving you the capital B, you don't have to look for that area of the base, and you will see some examples like that. So, Volume equals one third times area of the base, which is given. So times 28 times the height of the pyramid, which is 4.5. All right, so I'm going to multiply 28 times 4.5 first because I think it's easier for me. You can start by multiplying 28 times 1 then divide by 3, or you can say 28 times 1 times 4.5, then divide by 3. So, order operations, uh, it makes no difference where you start, okay, because you're multiplying and dividing. So, I'm going to multiply 28 times 4.5, I'm going to do it on the side, and I told you before that if you get confused with the decimal, you can also just multiply 28 times 45. And then once you get your answer, you just move your decimal one place to the left, okay? Five times eight is 40. Five times two is 10, plus four is 14. Okay. We add a zero here, and now four times eight, 32, and four times two is eight, plus three. And then we're gonna add these numbers, six, two, and one. Now we can move these uh, one place uh, to the left to add our decimal and the answer is 126, 126 so V equals 126 now we have to divide it by 3 so I'm also going to do it right here 126 divided by 3 3 times 4 is 12 12 minus 12 is 0. Bring the 6 down. 3 times 2 is 6. 6 minus 6 is 0 remainder. So the answer is of this volume is 42. Talking about volume, so it's cubic centimeters. And here's our answer. Okay? So here you have both side by side on the left side we have the triangular prism and on the right side we have the triangular pyramid i got this question earlier about what is the difference and how do i know well how do i know it's a triangular prism and how do i know if it's a triangular pyramid well based on the shape and uh that's how you know uh what formula to use if you look closely, the formulas are, the only difference is that for the pyramid, you have to divide by three. For the triangular prism, you find the area of the base, then you multiply times the height. For the pyramid, you, multi you find the area of the base if you have to, if it's not given, but then you multiply by the height, then divide by three. So this is the only difference that you have to divide by three. Again, let me know if you have any questions. Here. Pyramid. The only difference, it is the same formula. So I'm gonna write it uh, again. V equals one third capital B times H. 
same formula. Now, the difference, let me, oh, let me try and draw it. Um, all right, for the square pyramid, let me draw that square pyramid right here. This is the base. Sorry, I'm not very good at drawing. Um, this square is on the ground. Okay. So for the square pyramid, it is the same formula as the triangular pyramid. The difference is the base. The base here is a triangle, the base here is a square. So that being said, when we have to find the area of the base, that's the difference, the base is a square, so area equals side squared. 